Hi, Scott Whitley here, hope you're doing well. This is my first day back on tour after suffering from COVID for the past couple of weeks. I've been really ill, still got this brain fog thing going on, feeling quite fatigued, but you know, get in there. And of course, I'm super relieved that the, the vaccine did its job and I wasn't hospitalized. So anyway, onwards and upwards, here we are in a Premier Inn in Bedford. And this morning, I'm gonna look at some really interesting picks from Acoustic Attack. A lot of you might have seen these advertised on Facebook and the like, and they really caught my eye because they look a bit different and I like people that kind of think outside the box. So I wrote to the company direct and said I'd like to review the picks on the channel and they were kind enough to send me the selection pack, the arsenal as they call it. In this packet, which I've not opened yet, this is all gonna unfold before your very eyes. We've got two of what they call the blade picks, two of the attack picks, spelt with a K, and two ambush picks. So let's open them up and see what this is all about. So in the packet, we've got two of each pick. This one is the attack pick, and you might be able to see it's quite raised. You know, it's very textured is that pick. And then we've got the blade, which is more kind of ridges. Uh, hopefully you can see that on the camera. And finally, we've got the ambush pick, which is, I would say the least 3D of all the picks. They all feel pretty nice and flexible, which is what I like. I like a kind of thinner pick when I'm playing bass. The first pick I'm gonna look at is the attack pick. And it says here, enhances mid-range harmonics while exciting the upper mid harmonics. Brightens harmonics in the 1K to 5K range, giving solid clarity and presence. Various applications across electric, acoustic, and bass guitars. So let's give it a go. Scared to try it, here we go. Wow. Now you can really kind of feel it, you know, like tugging, at, you know, kind of gripping the strings. And I can really hear that it's doing something. Now let me just compare that to what I call like a regular pick. Right. So you can hear with that, that's just a regular nylon pick. You've just got that kind of instant attack and using the attack pick, if I do it slowly, you've got that kind of scraping going on. So let's, let's play with that for a minute. So I like it. I mean, I can't just off the top of my head. You know, I'd really need to sit with this for a while. And see how I'd really kind of like use that sound, but it is very, very cool. I kind of wondered how these would feel to play with. Um, and I like it. It's got this real, you get this real feedback from it, you know? I wonder how that translates to uh, drive. Straight flat pick. So it sounds a lot thicker with, with drive on, right? Very cool. So that kind of gets the thumbs up from me. So let's move on and let's check out the blade. This is the blade. This is the one that's kind of ridged uh, rather than having those like kind of little peaks on it or studs. And they say, harmonically enhances frequencies between 1K and 5K, which is where clarity and punch sit for guitars. Mitigates some of the muddiness of excess string resonance 
in the 150k to 300k range, which tends to make guitar sound a bit cloudy or lumpy. Great for faster picking styles like tremolo with all the tone of attack. So it sounds like this is maybe more of a guitar. Having said that, you can really hear what it's doing. Now, I'm gonna be honest, after reading some of the comments on Facebook about these picks, people who haven't tried them, by the way, but kind of ridiculing the idea, I was a little bit skeptical whether this was actually gonna do anything, but it really does. Um, so that pick sounds, to my ears, brighter, you know, it's doing a similar job to the attack pick, but that seemed to be kind of really pulling out, like it said, the, 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 the mid stuff. Check it out, I'm gonna go back to it quickly. Like a kind of thicker sort of tone. This blade one, you can hear it, right? It's brighter. Very, very cool. Now as well, what I'm noticing there is you can use the very tip of it and get a more sort of, you know, instant attack, similar to a flat pick, or you can really ride that sort of side edge of it. You really drag it. Very cool. And finally, onto the ambush pick. So the ambush is the least kind of textured or least 3D of the picks, I would say. It's similar to the attack, but it just seems to have kind of less ridges on it and, and, and smaller. So I don't know if you can check that out. So let's see what they say. Excites the upper mids to a greater degree than attack and blade. This would be interesting. Thickens the lower harmonics, which gives it a thicker sound and big feel. A great match for bass and acoustic guitars. Let's try it. It's very cool. Again, it's really kind of bringing this thickness to the sound. Let me just kind of revert back to um, a regular flat pick for a minute. That's really strange because just after a few minutes of using the attack picks, this sounds kind of flat, <laughs> you know. Uh, let me go back to the ambush. very cool I really like it uh, and I could certainly see how that could find a way to my heart let's see how that sounds with some drive That's really cool that, it's got this like really thick. Let's try a flat pick. It really works, right? And back to the ambush. It 
So I'm a convert. I think these are really, really cool. Now the only, the only issue I've maybe got with them is the price. Now I'm not saying the picks aren't worth the price. And I think you can get this exact pack that I got, uh, the, um, that guy, the Arsenal. So you get six picks, two of each for, I think it's $6. Um, which is, you know, it's pretty damn reasonable for, for like a fancy pick like this. When you hold them in the hand, they really are quite a beautiful thing. The only problem I've got is I lose things beyond belief. Um, I mean, I tend to carry around, you know, 30 picks on tour. So I've got plenty if I drop them um, or if I break one or whatever. So I'm, like I say, I mean, they're kind of pretty much in line at that price, I guess, with a lot of other picks. Um, it just depends. Maybe uh, they do a deal where, where you can buy them in bulk. I don't know. Uh, but I'll certainly be using these picks. I was a little bit scared of doing this review because I thought I might open the packet uh, and this just all be a complete load of, <laughs> you know, hype and, and baloney. But they really are very, very cool. So I highly recommend, uh, at the very least, checking out the Arsenal. You'll see them uh, advertised on Facebook all the time, popping up. Uh, it's a six pack of them and their website is acousticattack.com. I'm going to put that in the description below. It should be on the screen as well. But uh, let me see if I can just get that up. Highly recommended. Check them out. Stay safe and I'll see you in the next video. Cheers.